The tale of dark matter begins at the very start of everything, the Big Bang. Imagine the universe younger than a second old, a hot, dense soup of particles. As it expanded and cooled, conditions might have been just right to form dark matter particles. Unlike anything we're familiar with, these particles don't interact with light or electromagnetic forces, making them invisible and detectable only through their gravitational pull. Now, let's talk about what dark matter could actually be. One idea suggests it could be made of WIMPs, weakly interacting massive particles. These are large sluggish particles that barely interact with ordinary matter. Another candidate, axions, incredibly light, almost massless particles that could also solve some lingering questions in quantum mechanics. But wait, there's more. Some scientists speculate that dark matter could be primordial black holes formed right after the Big Bang from fluctuations in the density of matter not from collapsing stars. One of the most striking pieces of evidence for dark matter comes from observing cosmic collisions like the famous bullet cluster. Here the visible matter is separated from most of the mass causing gravitational effects, hinting strongly at the presence of dark matter. And while we're at it, let's not forget about dark energy, this mysterious force pushing the universe to expand faster. Some theories suggest there might be a connection between dark matter and dark energy. Could they be different sides of the same cosmic coin? As we continue to explore the cosmos with more advanced technology, we hope to find direct evidence of dark matter particles. With projects like the Large Hadron Collider and new space observatories, we're pushing the frontiers searching for those elusive wimps, axions or any other exotic particles. So the journey to understand dark matter isn't just about answering a scientific question, it's about unravelling the very fabric of the universe itself. Now that we've unveiled the shadowy origins and potential candidates of dark matter, let's dive into the cutting-edge experiments currently on the hunt for this elusive substance. First up, we have the Broadband Reflector Experiment for Axion Detection, or BREAD. This innovative experiment aims to detect hypothetical particles known as axions and their dark photon counterparts. Imagine scanning through 100,000 radio stations instead of tuning into just a few. BREAD's broad approach could lead to groundbreaking discoveries. Next, we journey to CERN's Large Hadron Collider, the world's largest and most powerful particle accelerator. While famed for discovering the Higgs boson, the LHC is also on a quest to create dark matter particles by colliding beams of protons at nearly the speed of light. This make it, break it or shake it method is crucial for deciphering dark matter's properties. In the depths of the Sanford Underground Research Facility in South Dakota, the Lux Zeppelin experiment is in full swing. This direct detection project focuses on weakly interacting massive particles, or WIMPs, another leading candidate for dark matter. Similarly, over in Italy, the Xenoant experiment is pushing the boundaries of dark matter detection. Located at the INFN Gran Sasso Laboratory, this collaboration of top xenon researchers aims to build the next generation dark matter detector, but why is detecting dark matter so challenging? For one, dark matter interacts very weakly with ordinary matter, primarily through gravity, making it extremely difficult to detect in laboratory conditions. Additionally, the theoretical mass range for dark matter particles spans an incredible 90 orders of magnitude complicating the design of experiments that can cover all potential masses. Dark matter's non-emission of light makes it invisible to traditional telescopes, suggesting it's composed of particles unlike those in ordinary matter. Since direct detection is elusive, scientists rely on indirect methods, observing the effects of dark matter on visible matter, radiation and the universe's large-scale structure. But knowing where and what to look for is a complex task. Background noise like cosmic rays and natural radioactivity can mimic dark matter signals, creating false positives. To combat this, experiments are often conducted deep underground, adding to their complexity and cost. And even if a potential dark matter particle is detected, multiple experiments and observations are required to confirm the discovery, necessitating a collaborative approach across different types of experiments. The quest to detect dark matter is a monumental challenge. But with each experiment, we inch closer to unravelling one of the universe's greatest mysteries.